Now to a heated meeting in Providence. Parents blasted school board members last night after a middle schooler was found with a ghost gun in school last week. 12 News reporter Eric Ritchie live in studio right now with what has them so upset. Well, of course, they're upset that a weapon made it into a classroom in the first place, but many said they're more upset that the there was not district wide communication about it. Only a letter the principal sent home to parents of students in that school. Now it was at Del Sesto Middle School last Wednesday. A teacher noticed a student acting suspicious, which according to police prompted that teacher to search the student's backpack. That's when he found a ghost gun and loaded magazine. This though coming on the heels of a student at the Kazarian Elementary School bringing a bullet to school to show friends about three weeks ago and put all of that together. It prompted this large and at times fiery conversation about school safety and security at last night's school board meeting. You can grandiose and clap when things are amazing, but you have to take that same zest vigor and you have to take that same level of responsibility when something goes wrong. If something goes wrong, that is on your watch. My top concern right now is safety. Every parent should expect that when they drop their child off to school, they will be able to pick them up in the same way. Now that student has since been charged with carrying a firearm on school grounds. The district decided not to place the school into a lockdown when this happened since the gun was secured by the teacher and immediately handed over to detectives. In studio this morning, Erica Ritchie, 12 News.